Hello guys, this is Epson L120 inkjet printer which has a standard warranty of 2 years Oh my god It has a bottled ink bottles of black, cyan, magenta, and yellow <laughs> Hi. My goodness What is this 664? Okay, okay, okay Here, you should handle it with care Anyway guys, uh, this printer has been already uh, converted into sublimation printer which means that the original ink are replaced by sublimation ink in a color black, yellow, magenta, and cyan Right? There you go uh, it, is a, it, is, it is the one of the cheapest uh, printer of Epson that you can find in the market so uh, I could use this in printing for t-shirts and other stuff so unboxing so we gotta remove all the ink inserted there you go yes that's a black So we're gonna set up now the printer. So we're gonna remove the plastic first. Oh, that, that's a cable cord, power cord. That's a paper support. Okay. Next, so we're gonna put the ink on the cartridges. So remove the cups. That's a black one. So make sure that the ink have no bubbles. So don't shake it. Because it might end up uh, having some bubbles inside the cartridges. Pour slightly, lightly. Make sure that the ink uh, reaches the highest of the cartridge. Next, the yellow one. Same step as we did in the black one. Or if you have some syringe, you can use it to pour the ink at the cartridges so that it won't be messy. That's a red one. On the cartridge, you see that there are two arrows up and down, which means that the arrow pointing down is the minimum uh, ink that you should uh, you should be use or when you will be uh, putting again some ink. So when you see that it already reaches the minimum, 
ay dararapilin. And the upper is the maximum ink that should be filled. Okay, cover it. Put it up. There you go. We're ready to calibrate it now. So, we put first the power cable. Insert it at the back of the printer. Hey, come on, faster! My goodness, too slow. Then we're, we're gonna plug in it and turn it on. And we're gonna calibrate it for 20 30 minutes. After calibrating, we're gonna make a test print now.